If you want to display events from your Google Calendar easily, you can use the Google Calendar widget. To activate this widget, go to the ATIMS add-ons dashboard, use the search field and search for Google, activate the widget, now move over to the page where you want to add this widget, use the search field, and drag the widget. You can see a calendar shows up. You have to add your Google App API key here and your calendar ID here. You can click this link to find out how to obtain this uh, information. And all your Google events will show up here. Let's have a look at the settings. So first of all, you can change the language. You can change the initial view. Right now, the monthly view is displayed, but you can change it today week you can change to a 24 hour format like this just by clicking the button you can change the first day of the week you can hide past events and you can hide the event link if you don't want to redirect to your google calendar url there are also plenty of styling options available You can change the padding, add some background color like this for the whole calendar. You can change the text color, border color, border width, border radius. There are options available for the toolbar, so this area right here. You can change the color, change the typography if you want to. Let's set a different font family for example, say like this. You can. Uh, Customize the buttons, something like this. You can see now there's a border radius here. You can add some padding. You can change uh, the, the colors for each state, so normal, hover, and active. So, for example, let's say for the active button, I'm going to make it like this red. Here it is. And for hover, I want it to be like this. Here it is. You can also change the table header, so I can add some padding, some typography, settings, colors, background colors. I can change the alignment as you can see. Of course for table cells, I can change plenty of options. Something like this for example. I can change the background just for this day, so the table highlights the current day automatically. And of course I have styling options available for the events as well. That's it, thank you for watching.